Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Aurora and today is Saturday. It's about 11 p.m. and I've just been busy all day, but I wanted to show you some of the things I've picked up throughout the day because I've been quite a few places, um, but we'll just jump right in. So first of all, my mom and I decided to divide and conquer today. Um, I went to Aldi, she went to Walmart and to another grocery store to get what we needed. And while I was at Aldi, I picked up these two pack of helper shells. Um, these were only $4.99 for the two pack. And I thought it was a really good deal. Um, you can use these in cabinets for organization, for dishes, under underneath your sink, whatever. Um, I thought these were just great for $4.99. And they did have another style that was kind of like a three tier corner type thing. And I was really interested in that because I've been looking for a corner shelf to put in my bathroom um, and put my skincare on top of, but the middle shelf wasn't removable, so I wouldn't be able to put my products like underneath. Um, but that was also only $4.99. So if you are looking for these, check out Aldi. And then the other thing I grabbed for myself is this little cereal milkshake candle. It was only $2.50. Um, I don't know. I, I can't smell too much of it right now. Like it doesn't smell like cereal or milkshake, um, but maybe once I light it, it'll have a nice scent because right now it's very faint and I don't really get a whiff of like cereal, but I'm a big fan of cereal milk and this just caught my eye and the label is so, so cute on it. Um, so burn that. So since my mom went to Walmart, I had her return um, some clothing that I had purchased from walmart.com that just didn't fit and um, I told her I was like well with the refund can you see if they have these little faux crocs <laughs> and she did find them these are from the time and true brand I got them in a size nine which I wear a nine and a half and these fit perfectly and they were only ten dollars um, and I just think they're so cute they're gonna be really really comfortable but the reason that I got these was because in my last order um from Shop Miss A, I got these little, like this little charm, and you're supposed to be able to stick it through the hole in here, and it's like a little charm on your crock. And I wasn't sure, I didn't buy more of them because I didn't have any crocs, but now I have these generic crocs, and they do work really well. Like you can put your little, you can choose out your little charms and then stick them all in the holes there. So I'm definitely gonna be ordering some more of these because I think they're so cute. And these are just gonna be good. You know, I'm taking my dog out, running errands, whatever. Um, I've never had the real Crocs, so I don't know how they compare, but they look the same. And I'm pretty sure they're gonna like work the same way too. And you can wash them out. Um, yeah, I'm excited about these. And then the other thing that she got me for Valentine's Day actually, um, is this Kamenstein set of electric grinders so I can put, you know, peppercorns and maybe Himalayan salt or rock salt or something like that on the other side and it will grind them up for me. And I've been talking about these and telling her that I wanted a set um, and she found them at Walmart. I want to say she paid maybe $18, $19 for the set. Um, and this is like my Valentine's Day gift from her. So I'm really, really excited about this. Um, cause I just think they're so cool and I see people using them and it's like, I want some. So we went to Kohl's. There really wasn't much there, but I did buy two things. So the first is this set of aloe gloves and socks from the brand Earth Therapeutics. As you can see, it was on clearance for 520. I think it's like leftover from like Christmas and my mom had a 30% off coupon. I ended up getting these for $3.64. And I've just been wanting some of these like aloe gloves and aloe socks. Um, I've been really good about moisturizing my feet every night so they're not like crusty. <laughs> and um, I think the gloves will be nice as well. So it's just a cute little set. And then I also got this hoodie that I'm wearing. It's just a basic hoodie tie dye. Um, it's from the Sonoma brand. It was on sale for $14.99. So after the 30% off coupon, it came out to $11.50. And I thought it was cute. It was a good deal. Um, and I went ahead and purchased it. I will say normally in Sonoma, I buy a 1X because they tend to be like run a little bit larger. But this one is definitely true to size. So I did get it in a 2X and it fits perfectly. They also had the matching pants 
for $14.99. Um, but I didn't get those because I actually don't like sweats. <laughs> I like lounge pants, but I like them to be like a thinner material. Um, I feel like sweats, I just get too hot and it's like too thick. I don't know. I don't like them. Um, so I didn't get those, but this is just like true, like sweatpants, sweatshirt material. I actually came home and I put it on because it's really cold today. Yesterday was almost 80 degrees. It was 79 and today the high was 37 and then tomorrow it's supposed to be like 69 again so crazy weather but i came home i put it on and once we finished up at kohl's it was like 8 30 at night and we decided to just pick up some food from taco bell and i got like the meal deal for a chicken quesadilla it came with a taco and a drink and then my mom got like a burrito supreme combo with a with a couple of tacos and a drink. And it was one of those Taco Bells that's like half Taco Bell, half KFC. And we went through the drive-thru, we placed our order, like the cashier repeated back to us like what we had ordered, we paid. And then she's like, she gave us our drinks and then she's like, can you actually pull around to the front because like we'll take your order out there. And I was like, okay. So we go, we pull around to the front of the building, we park and we're waiting. And then they come out and they're bringing us like a bucket of KFC chicken. <laughs> and they're like, here's your order. And I'm like, wait, no, no. <laughs> we ordered Taco Bell, we didn't order KFC. So they took it back inside and then we were still waiting for another 10 minutes. And then they come out again and they're like, here's your order. And they hand me a bag. It was Taco Bell this time. So I took it, I just handed it over to my mother. But when I grabbed it, I felt like it felt really heavy, but I just didn't think about it. I, and I should know better because my orders at fast food places always get messed up. But I just handed it to my mother and we came home. And this Taco Bell is, you know, over where the Coles is at. It's not necessarily super close to our house. So once we got home and we started unpacking things, there were like 10 potato soft tacos in there, two bean chalupas, a bean burrito, and then two rice and beef burritos. <laughs> and I was like, why? All I wanted was a chicken quesadilla and a taco. <laughs> And I was like, I'm, and my mom's like, well, call them or go back. And I was like, no, it's like too far. It's, it was already like 9 p.m. I was like, I don't want to drive over there and then have them fix the order and then have to drive back. Um, actually, now that I think about it, I didn't even get a receipt. Like they didn't give me one. Anyways, I was like, and, and there, I was like, it's just not worth it. Like, let's just pick something to eat out of this and like whatever but I just I don't understand how like orders can get so messed up like all you have to do is check in the bag to make sure like it matches the order on the screen but anyways yeah so I didn't even like I ate a potato soft taco and then one of the burritos but that is not at all what I wanted for dinner so after that I um was just like you know, winding down for the evening. But earlier in the day, my mom had told me that she didn't have any more toothpaste. And um, I haven't been couponing recently because um, I, for the most part, I felt like we were well stocked with everything. But I do realize that the toothpaste I had gotten my mother were like smaller tubes. So she was going through them faster. And I was like, okay, well, I'll get you some more. And I was just looking at the couponing deals at Walgreens and uh, the coupon expired today, which is why I had to go today. And they had a pretty good deal on the toothpaste that she uses. So I'll show you what I ended up getting at Walgreens. But I'm really like, I used to love couponing at Walgreens. It was so easy. You could do it online. You could do pickup orders. And then they changed, um, when they changed their weekly ad format to their new format, and then they changed the deals of the week, from giving you Walgreens cash to giving you register rewards. I've had so many issues couponing there. Um, so like I said, I had taken a break just cause I felt like we were fully stocked with what we needed. But at the same time, like I just didn't want to coupon at Walgreens anymore cause so many things were getting messed up. 
and anytime I would try and get things that had that would give you register rewards I never got the register rewards and this was a deal with the toothpaste where they were offering register rewards but I didn't account for that because I was like I'm probably not going to get them so I got her three tubes of the Colgate Total Whitening Toothpaste. These are the 4.8 ounces. They were on sale this week for $3.99 each. And if you purchased three, there was a $5 off coupon. And then if you purchased two or more, you would get a $5 register reward. But like I said, I wasn't counting on the register reward. I was just like, I'll buy these um, for $12 minus the $5 manufacturer coupon, so that's $7. And then I was also gonna get um, like a $4 Walgreens cash for having a purchase over $12. Um, so that brought the price of these to $3. So I paid a dollar for each tube of toothpaste and she should be good for the next couple of weeks. And then another deal that I kind of quickly put together. So I am about halfway through of the bottle of this that I currently have, and I know it's gonna need a backup soon. So this is the Neutrogena Clear Pore Oil Eliminating Astrogent. This is my Ride or Die Holy Grail toner. Um, I've used it for years and years. I have tried other toners, drugstore, high-end, but I always come back to this um, because it's just so, so good. And I don't recommend it unless you have extremely oily skin and your skin isn't particularly sensitive because it does burn a little bit, but it is so good at cleaning out your pores. I also think this is a good test for any um, like facial cleanser that you might have because you might think that that facial cleanser is getting your face clean, but once you put this on a cotton round and wipe your face, like it will let you know if your facial cleanser is doing its job or not. But like I said, this is my holy grail. Um, I think the cheapest you can get it, like regular price, is like $5 at Walmart. And this was $6.97 at Walgreens, but there was a $3 manufacturer coupon, so I got it for $3.79. And it was also part of this deal where if you purchased, it was like a mix and match deal. If you purchased two items, you would get a third item free. So like I said, this was $6.79 and I had a $3 manufacturer coupon, so I got it for $3.79. And then these were part of that buy two, get one free. And this is from Soap and Glory. So this is the original pink fragrance spray. It's only 3.7 ounces. Um, and then this is the Clean On Me Creamy Shower Gel and it's 8.4 ounces. And this was $7 and this was $6.50, I think. Um, so I paid $7 for this and then this was completely free. So it's like I got each one of these for $3.50 each, which is pretty good for Soap and Glory because these products can usually be pretty expensive. And I do like the scent of the original pink. I'm running out of my current body spray. Um, so I thought this one would be a nice one to replace it with. Um, I haven't been wearing a lot of perfume because I don't go anywhere. I'm working from home and I'm usually at home, but just part of my everyday like body care routine after I shower, um, I always put on a fragrance mist, um, like a body spray. And uh, like I said, I'm running out of the one I had, so this one is gonna be good. And then I thought I would just try this Clean On Me. I love different shower gels. And this one says it's got like a built-in body lotion. Um, and since my skin is dry, like my body skin is dry, my face skin is oily, um, but I thought I'd give this a shot. And like I said, for $3.50 each, I thought that was a pretty good deal. Um, but I haven't really been couponing recently um, because it takes a lot of time. You know, calculating the deal, making sure everything's correct, you have all your digital coupons clipped, making sure you know like the sizes and the different varieties that the coupon will apply to, um, and then just, just planning it all out and then actually going to the store and then half the time what you're looking for isn't even in stock. So you have to kind of adjust on the fly. It just takes a lot of time. And there's been so many other things going on that 
I just kind of put it on the back burner. But like I said, my mom needed toothpaste and, and I got a good deal on these, a dollar each. Um, and I'll coupon kind of as needed when I see that we're running out of something. But yeah, the everyday couponing or every week couponing, it can it can get pretty stressful because like I said, you have to, you know, work out your deals perfectly and you know make sure that your everything's calculating the way it should be calculating. And then you run into issues like Walgreens not printing register rewards at all. Um and and the reason I bring that up is because I wasn't counting on the register reward, but when I was cashing out, two little kind of Catalinas printed, and this is usually how they print the register rewards. And I was like, oh my goodness, two are printing, that means I'm gonna get my $5, but no. Like this one is 20% off 10 or more, and then this is just a little advertisement for deodorant, prescription deodorant. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Let me know if you coupon and you go to Walgreens, are your register rewards printing? Um, I do need to find something for my mother for Valentine's Day. Um, I'm not sure what to get her. I always get her like clothes or purses, but I just want to get her something different. Um, and so I'm still trying to figure out what to do there. I, I did talk to her about going on a trip though. I, I want to go on a trip to Branson, Missouri, even if it's just like a weekend. I think it would be a nice little getaway. We can get like they have different resorts and hotels on the lakes. Um, I want to do a train ride like through the whole Ozarks area. They have a museum there that's like a replica of the Titanic, which I think would also be very cool. And then there's a play that I want to go see. So we're working on planning that little trip. Um, I do need to find a daycare for my dog, though, to make sure he's taken care of. And yeah, I'll, I'll keep you guys posted on that. And hopefully when we go, I can actually bring you along as well. Um, but I think that's it for today. It was just kind of a little chat, catch up, show you what I got. Um, but I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye. Thank you.